Hello guys, this is Rainter Videos here. Today I'm going to be making the um, graph that will help, will, should help you with your ratios or proportions. Um, and this graph will not only help you with that or should help you with that, you will be learning to graph the points. And so here we go. Let's take a problem from here. Sweet Swirl Yogurt Shop sells yogurt and toppings by the ounce. The price per ounce is 50 cents. What will the cost be for a 14 ounce serving, a 7 ounce serving, and a 10 ounce serving, and a 5 ounce serving? Well, I might have not gotten it right. We don't really know yet. But So what we're going to do is we're going to take these markers and we're going to draw the average or normal graph base like this so it should look something like this now what we do is we list the ounces labels and numbers ounces labels and numbers across the run rise and run for our prices, we name it up to 1 and 10. Here we go. Now, what we do is we take these two markers. Red will be the lowest. Blue will be the highest. Now we will match them right to our price that we have. Like this. So now it should end up like this. Now what we do is we make it like a triangle but a right, right triangle so we will connect these two with the black marker now your label should fit inside of the right triangle or the graph if it isn't then you might want to retry doing or try redoing it over again otherwise it's wrong now across here you rewrite our equation and here or on each line, we will write what we had to multiply to get our price or our answer. Like this. We have to multiply 50 cents, and our equation is cost equals price times ounce. That means price per ounce equals the cost. Now here is our graph. Otherwise, if you were looking for unit rate, rise, run, slope. Or you can just remember RRS for rise, run, and slope. Hope this helped. Sorry this video was so short, didn't explain much, but there will hopefully be more. Hope you understand. Thanks.